All right, welcome back to KM6 LYW Radio, the show about amateur radio or ham radio with an emphasis on digital or data moods, moving information back and forth, uh, trying to reimagine amateur radio in the information age. Hey, we've got the uh, DigiPi Raspberry Pi hooked up to the ICOM 705. It's on an APRS packet frequency. And today we're going to see if we can make a DX contact using APRS packet radio uh, to the nation of, um, there's an operator there in the nation of Kazakhstan. That's uh, southern Siberia. You might be familiar with that. So let's, let's do that this time on KM6 LYW Radio. Yeah. There we go. All right, welcome back. Okay, so APRS packet, that's the bumper music. I can't believe we're still getting away with that. And I'm running out of jingles, guys, so give me jingles if, if you got them, okay? All right, hopefully I've got this worked out with the time differences here between, I'm in California, and then Kazakhstan, of course, is southern Siberia. Um, again, we've got the ICOM 705 here hooked up to the DigiPi. It is an APRS mode. You can get digipi at digipi.org. It goes to patrons of the channel. And we're going to see if we can use APRS web chat to, uh, to make a contact here. And uh, the person we're going to contact, his name is Borat Sagidev. Sagidev, I'm sure I'm not saying that right. Um, I, it's uh, from Kazakhstan. Uh, you might know him from his uh, filmmaking stuff. He does documentaries, uh, the most popular, of which was the Cultural Learnings of America for Make Great Benefit, Glorious Nation of Kazakhstan. So uh, his call sign is actually WB4BOR. And uh, we're on the DigiPi here. We've got APRS web chat running. We're in iGate mode. Uh, I can see that's happening. We'll go over to click on the web chat link, and uh, here we are. So again, uh, let's see if we can make a contact here, WB4BOR-11, and any of you can contact him, you know, just be uh, kind of be nice. Remember, um, there's some language barriers here if you, if you don't speak uh, Kazakhstan. I don't know, is, that even a, is that even a language? So, okay, let's see. Bor let's see. Borat, are you there? Borat, are you there? And we're going to send that message to call sign WB4BOR using the DigiPi, which is going to send it out on the APRS frequency, which is 144390 here in America. And I'm going to send now. And we can see it says, Borat, are you there? Let's see what he says. And he says, I like to make sexy time. Okay. All right. I, I told myself I wouldn't do the accent. All right. Uh, Borat, what radio are you using? Uh, let's, see what he's, let's see what he says. Borat, what radio are you using? I got the little thumbs up there. That indicates uh, that I got acknowledgement back from Borat's radio. Um, so uh, it says, in Kazakhstan, we have many hobbies, disco, dancing, archery, and table tennis. Okay. Borat, you know, I'm sure there's a language barrier here. So again, let's send another message to WB4BOR. Actually, this is happening pretty fast. Now, now the endpoints are all over RF, right? I could be completely offline using an amateur radio uh, with no power, no internet, nothing. And we're going to send packets out over RF on 14439 megahertz. And then if the person's really far away, you know, in some other country, obviously the internet's going to make up the middle portion of that, and then the endpoint will be RF again. Now, it's uh, it degrades gracefully, so with APRS, if there's no internet and the two radios are in range, or in range of digipeters, like I could, do, I could talk to another radio almost directly in Northern California with no internet whatsoever, but obviously we're getting a little help from the internet here to talk to Borat. So uh, I can say, uh, Borat, um, thanks for helping with the channel and we'll see what he says here all right Borat we're waiting for the thumb to go up your thumb went up and he says yakshamash I, I, I don't I'm not sure what that means I hope I hope that's not offensive to anyone but yeah we'd like to thank Borat here not only would we like to thank Borat but we'd like to thank uh, the APRSD software which is running this back end uh, myself and WB4BOR, no coincidence, that's actually his call sign, Walt. <laughs> Walt Boring, thank you, buddy, for helping out with the APRS Damon. So WB4BOR-11 is a radio you can talk to. Um, and, of course, it has the Borat plug-in. It's running APRS D, APRS Damon. And so this is if you're even a, just a, a, a simple Python programmer, you can AP, use APRS D to write a plug-in, hopefully something infinitely more useful than the Borat plug-in. Um, I was actually thinking maybe we could hook up ChatGPT on here. So if you guys are, are quick with Python, you can use the APRSD on GitHub. That's github.com slash 
github.com slash craigerl slash APRSD. Um, that's where the code is here. You can check that out, get that running, and you can have an APRS station autoresponder like we just demonstrated here. So uh, let's come up with some cool other plugins. We've got other things like... Um, We've got like a weather plugin. Um, of course, you can, uh, there's the web chat plugin, which is what you just saw here. This whole web page that allows you to use APRS over a KISS interface to do web chat. We can do that here. Um, so we've got uh, ping, version time, weather, like I said. Uh, you can do email uh, if you specify a very specific email address. So APRSD, that's really the software <laughs> we're trying to do here. And I am not a comedian at all. So I apologize if how offensive this is to the rest of you. But anyways, try it out. Uh, send a message that starts with Borat um, to WB4BOR-11. And uh, if you'd like to talk to Borat Jagadesh in uh, Kazakhstan. Uh, hey, no one would be talking to Borat right now if it wasn't for the patrons of the channel. Um, that's you guys. So patrons get access to the DigiPi software image, which is all the software you just saw me use here today. In fact, it has APRSD pre-installed on it. So if you want to make an APRS server, that's also on DigiPi. That's usually not something I advertise. And that gives you the web chat interface. It gives you all the plugins. You can have a virtual radio that responds to APRS commands and write your own uh, commands. Um, it's a lot of fun. Okay, so patrons of the channel, Steve, Andrew, NW2W, that's Mark, Fu, Brian, Chris, Malcolm, Jim, Paul, Jake, Buddy, Robert, hey, we are on uh, we are on Discord all the time. Uh, we, have, we have a lot of uh, email, there's an email list, there's a Google group for DigiPi, um, a lot of great operators here. There are so many of you, I cannot read all of the names. Um, I guess Borat's not officially a, a Patreon subscriber, but being a patron gets you access to the, the, the DigiPi SD card image, which is what we've got booted in this Raspberry Pi over here. So uh, let's keep going all the way down to the bottom here. I know everyone's kind of looking for their name here, all the way down to Mark Thompson. So thank you guys. I really appreciate it. So patreon.com slash KM6LYW. Anything gets you access to the DigiPi SD card image, which is at digipi.com. Org, and you can talk to Borat using the web chat SD card interface. Actually, the web chat web interface is open source. You can download and run that. So is APRSD. You don't really need DigiPi to run those, but it's all pre-installed and pre-configured, and you can use every data mode there is on DigiPi using nothing more than your web browser. Um, it could be on a Wi-Fi device or your tablet or your phone. Um, <laughs> if you, all, like, all these modes are available to you. Now, this has been an entirely useless, useless use of amateur radio uh, with the Borat plugin, but it really demonstrates uh, what we can do with virtual radio. So I'm kind of excited about um, you guys and your imagination um, coming up with virtual plugins uh, for or actual plugins for virtual radios that can do something cool. I was thinking of doing something along the lines of chat GPT where you could actually have your APRS radio um, send packets to a chat GPT bot and actually get useful information over ham radio. I don't know, right? That's what this channel is about, moving information back and forth. All right, guys. Hey, my name is Craig. I'm in California. Uh, this has been another KM6LYW radio production, and I am clear. <laughs>